Here at American Shave, we're a family business. Since we opened the doors, my brother-in-law Ralph has been with us. My name is Ralph, and I'm a barber at American Shave. I've been cutting hair for a while now. When Manny opened up the shop, he asked me to join him, and I've been here ever since. Ralph's very meticulous when it comes to cutting hair. He takes his time, and he wants to make sure that the customer leaves happy. Today, I had an appointment for the haircut. And John, the producer, stepped in and volunteered. Hey, I'm John Rebecca. I'm a producer on Behind the Blade. I'm also a part of two other production companies, Sans Pants and Scrapping the Tin Man. There is no Sesame Street. But there is, I, I go there all of the time. I could tell you how to get there. No count, I can tell you how to get to Sesame Street. Two lines of coke and a tab of acid. Ah, two lines of coke. Ah, 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 yeah, yeah. ah, 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 Stop! Ah, ah. Counting ah, 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 everything! Sans ah, ah, ah. Pants Productions started off as a sketch comedy group but we've evolved into a full-scale production team, producing works from commercials to music videos. Smear Body Spray makes you a chick magnet. Grabbing the Tin Man focuses more on feature films and narrative shorts. If you think that Sean is having visions, then you're just as crazy as he is. If my God be paid, then the night be his cleric and this be my confession. I will watch this town burn to the ground before I see my friend die. So we've been shooting Behind the Blade for six months now and the running theme is that the customers just let the barbers do pretty much whatever they want. I'm thinking I just let you do something to my beard, do something with this up here, yeah, leave it in your hands. We started off with a shave, trying different things. Uh, John's a bit of a character. Ralph knows I like to joke around. <laughs> <laughs> so he took me on this beard journey from full, forced into options, yeah, to macho man, to patchy, yeah, right. <laughs> even a little bit more. <laughs> Ralph. John, that looks good. What this is kind of like you. I try to give John a look that I'm fond of, but he didn't like it. You know what I've always wanted? I've always wanted just a clean, straight razor shave. Wow. Just let it looks great. Off. <laughs> oh, cool. oh wow. Yeah, I haven't seen my face in a long in a while. I've only had like three hairstyles my entire life. So I wanted to envision myself in different personalities. Let the transformation begin. We tried a few different haircuts with John. Uh, we tried the comb over. Okay. He didn't like it. We continued on to a slick back. I tried a Caesar Justin Bieber look. The look works for him. It just wasn't him. And then we landed on messy. Clean on the sides, clean in the back, messy on top. Which is a twist on my current style, but better. <laughs> not too short, not too long, just right. You Goldilocks it. It's nice. Oh, hey, Yoyce, what's up? Thanks for videotaping this. So what do you think? You like it? I love it, Ralph. Looks great. My name is Rob. You're watching Behind the Blade. Stay tuned for more episodes. Take cinco.
make sure you log on to theamericanshave.com for pictures, galleries, shopping, and more.